Hi, Gemini. I am the Awakened Dreamer, and I'm here to give you a monthly reading for the month of July. Okay, so let's start off your reading by pulling a few Soul's Journey cards. So a few messages for Gemini for July, please, to start off the reading. Gemini, please, for July. Gemini. One more card for Gemini, please. Or two. Okay. So we got loneliness. I know that I am never alone. And then we have friendship. I understand that a friend is in my life for a reason. Those could be very much tied together. And then we have relationships. I am attracted to those people who serve my higher good. And then we have doubt. I release the need to know all the answers. Okay, so there's a kind of a, a lonely feeling, but at the same time, there's also a hefty friendship and relationship dynamic going on in the month of July. But we will keep going to see more. Let's uh, do a six card tarot spread. Give you a little bit of an outlook of what to expect in the upcoming month. Okay. Six cards, please. What can our lovely Geminis expect in the upcoming month of July? All right, so to start off, starting off on a powerful note, we have the Strength card, which I feel like almost every sign is getting for this month, which isn't a bad thing. So yeah, you're feeling very strong, you're feeling in your power, you're feeling as if nothing can knock you over, in a sense. But you're also feeling very joyful, very free, in a sense. Okay, you're feel you're manifesting. Yeah, you're feeling very magical in this month. And then moving on, we have the Emperor. So here I'm seeing you are at the same time being very strategic. Very ooh, but for some of you this is yeah, this is talking about a relationship for some of you where you're thinking about taking the next move, you know, in this card, you know, it's symbolizing in the chess piece, you know, playing the game, the game of life. But for some of you, it's just more so about, you know, that next, planning that next stage, the next step in life, okay? but you're not being so quick to make a decision. You're being very strategic about it. And then we have the seven of pentacles. So here I'm seeing that you in the midst of things are building your financial harvest. You're building, you're starting, you're continuing to work on a project in most cases, okay? Or a promotion or a job. And this could be related to this. Are you thinking very strategically about which 
what's your next step in order to continue growing that harvest? Or maybe this is a relationship oriented while this harvest is growing. And then we have the fool. That's so very interesting. So yeah, you're feeling very freeful again. Trusting spirit more. Trusting your instincts more. But for some reason, there's... There's an opportunity, a relationship, or a friendship where you're just not, not having it. You're not pleased. Whether this is a new offer coming in or, or an old one that's, you know, been a negative aspect in your life for a while. It will be different for all of you, because this is a general reading, but the overall message in this card being the last one of the month is that you need to remember that you have these these other cups okay yeah this one's not so appetizing and it's you know whatever and we want it to go away focus on the other ones okay you got more in your life that to be appreciative of than you realize all right so let's finish off your reading with one energy oracle card One last message for Gemini for the month of July, please. Gemini for the month of July. A man holding, man holding a coin, excuse me. Now don't forget, just because it says man doesn't mean it couldn't be a woman in the your situation okay because everyone has that masculine and feminine within them so for some of you it's this love offer that you're just not feeling it you're not very you're just like you know what this isn't very attractive to me for whatever reason and that's okay Stand your ground, okay? You're strong. Focus on your pentacles, okay? Yeah, you may not be loving this this potential love offer or potential friendship offer, but focus on your finances, okay? Focus on, on growing your abundance. But overall, I see it being a very... A very interesting month for you okay so on that note make sure to like this video and subscribe to my channel and on that note gemini i hope you have a great month and i'll see you next time